Parents in East Baton Rouge, listen up. You'll need to reset your alarms for school next week. NBC Local 33's Jacqueline Kissick is live in the parish where school board leaders vote tonight to approve new start and end times for middle and high schoolers. Jacqueline, will this be a big change? Well, Renee, starting Monday, it's going to be a little different for high schoolers and middle schoolers here at East Baton Rouge Parish. Now, the board originally voted on a 15 minute time difference. Well, now it's split into seven minutes. Now, the schools will be starting two minutes earlier and ending five minutes later. Now, this just won't impact students, but it also will impact teachers and school bus drivers. Adding that extra 13 minutes to each day is going to cost money because teachers are under contract. At Thursday night's special school board meeting, the board votes to approve new start times for the middle and high school. The goal is to work with new bus routes approved this week, but some teachers like Craig Bilbrew say this won't be an easy change. And the teachers stay an additional 20 minutes, so that'll take, put us out at 3 o'clock. So if you have a part-time job that you're supposed to get to, then we don't have the option of staying after school for parent conferences or making phone calls. Board members had several options to choose from. Bill Bruce says one option was to take away recess. It was immediately shot down, but he thinks that it would have been the best option for teachers and students. We would be making a lot of people upset. I get it, they'd be upset, but which one is more important? learning how to read, write, and do math, or playing around outside. The new bus routes come after half of the bus operators went on strike, demanding better pay. This causing early dismissal. You know, I have faith in my co in my colleagues. Sometimes we have differences of opinion, and this was one of those. Board member Patrick Martin, one of two board members to shoot down the new times. He says many students have already been disrupted in school by the sudden change in transportation. My concern is that this is just further disruption. These minor changes, the addition of a minute or two to a schedule block here and there, don't really add up to extra actual learning to make up for the learning that they've missed. Bill Burr says he hopes the board, along with Superintendent Dr. Cito Narcisse, realize who they should be looking out for, the children. Look at the constituents that they are supposed to serve and take the, the true value and interest into heart when they're making the decisions and then do what's best for the children. And this Friday, the school system is having a transportation hiring event, hoping to bring in potential bus drivers for more than $13 an hour. Be sure to visit our website at brproud.com to find out those details. Now reporting live in East Baton Rouge Parish, I'm Jacqueline Kissick, NBC Local 33 News. All right, Jacqueline, thank you for that live report for us tonight.